Martinez's Pinpoint 2 forecast, broadcast certified by the American Meteorological Society. All right, happy Tuesday morning to you. Time now, 548. Coming up on 549, start out with this gorgeous weather shot of the day. Look at this. Eleanor Preger out there to Lake Tahoe. Tulips are up. The boat is out. Boy, oh boy, perfect time of year, getting ready for summertime for sure. Summer is just about a month away, uh, folks. Today, upper 70s for Lake Tahoe. Right now, you're in the 40s, about 77 for your high, light winds. So it's going to be a beautiful uh, day out there. It'll get a little breezy by tomorrow and Thursday. That's when we have a cool front heading our way, and that'll drop our temperatures off a little bit by Friday. But uh, looks pretty good right through with this holiday weekend. As we take a live look, there, uh, there's the sun. Beautiful out there. This is from Homewood Mountain Resort, looking off uh, toward the east there, of course, and a beautiful uh, morning out there. Temperatures in the 40s right now, but I want to talk about the Walker River. Yesterday, we were thinking it was going to come up around major flood stage. Good news this morning, kind of revised the forecast a little bit. River levels don't look to be that quite uh, as uh, bad. We're going to see it right around moderate flood stage now, right about by Friday into Saturday. So it is lower than what we were anticipating. Not quite as much snow melt uh, that we uh, saw, and uh, more river sensors here giving us a better idea. Idea. So good news, but definitely keep those sandbags ready with all of that snowpack still melting off fast, especially today with temperatures pushing 90 for most of us. 58 beautiful degrees. Very nice out there this morning. Not bad at all. 43 up instead. Maybe a light coat down around Minden and Gardnerville. 43 for you and in Truckee. A little bit of fog at this hour. 37 degrees. Good morning, Lovelock. You're at 58. We have 46 in Elko. So a nice day today. High pressure. Big ridge of high pressure keeping pretty much the western half of the country uh, storm free. By Wednesday, a little cool front pushes through. Slight chance for an isolated shower north of us. I don't think we'll see too much. Just a little wind Wednesday and Thursday. And then Friday, temperatures drop off in the 70s. And then after that, beautiful weekend, uh, Saturday, Sunday, right through Memorial Day. It's just going to be gorgeous out there, as you will see with our temperatures. Beautiful today, very uh, warm by this afternoon, 80 degrees at noon. And yeah, 90 degrees for the high today. Same story for Lovelock and Fallon, about 90 for you. Bishop, 93. And Vegas will hit the century mark today, 100 down there. Too hot, too early, right? 78 in Ely, that sounds nice. About the same for Austin. We'll do 84 in Elko, finally getting in the 80s here. And again, some 90s out toward Fallon. 82 in uh, Truckee, 78 for South Lake Tahoe. 89 in Harrington and 91 in Fernley. Uh, so we start to be a little bit cooler tomorrow as that front starts to slide on in. 82 on Thursday, 70s for Friday, but then Saturday, Sunday, Memorial Day, we're back up in the 80s. Just perfect conditions for all of your outdoor plans. So get out there and uh, dress cool today. 90 degrees for our high. Could be our first 90 of the season. John and Andy, back to you. Speaking of days ahead, the Chick-fil-A countdown clock now reads two days till grand opening Thursday. 6 a.m. And they fully expect, because they've seen this in other cities, people will be camping out. There probably are already. Because the first 100 people get free Chick-fil-A for a year or some beautiful thing. And so people do camp out. 48 hours. And you don't want to get behind me in line. What happens? What happens? I got a list. Coming up <laughs> on Channel 2 News uh, this morning.